it's important to be able to have your workpiece held by uh, some kind of vice when you're working with it. It really is very helpful in order to have both hands free to do everything that you need to do when you're soldering. And so what we use are these different types of vices to hold our workpiece. We have a couple of examples here. This is the first one I'd like to show. This is a pan of vice, which allows us to manipulate the part in different orientations that makes it more convenient for us to work with. For example, if we need access to both sides of the board, we can tilt the board up on edge and have access with both hands from either side. For some smaller boards, it may be possible to grip it from the edges, like this. And for that, you might use a, a vise that has a, a wider jaw. But if you're working with something very, very small, it might fit in a vise like this. So it's nice to have something with a, a, a wider jaw. And finally, for large parts, you get run into the problem where the board begins to flex when you apply pressure. So in that case, it's often helpful to have two vices handy so that you can clamp it from both sides. In this case, we have a lot more force that we can apply before the, the board bends and flexes. So sometimes it's helpful uh, on a larger board to have two vices. So just to reiterate, it's important to have something to hold your workpiece so that you can have your hands free when you're working with soldering iron and your solder.